All right, right now it is time to see what is clicking in Cleveland. And for that, we bring in our digital anchor, Stephanie Haney. Hey, Stephanie, good to see you again on this Monday. Uh, again, I I'm sure Brown's really driving internet traffic here in Cleveland today. Yep, you're right about that, Jay. Good to see you, too. And you know, the Brown season ending last night was obviously a heartbreaker, but the fans still showed up to show the team how much they mean to them. The fans lined up outside of Cleveland Hopkins International Airport to cheer for the Browns as they returned home Sunday night from Kansas City. They waited it out in the snow to show the team how proud they are after that incredible season. It wasn't the outcome we wanted, but it was still a lot of fun. And this season really did mean a lot to a lot of people. The reaction online after the game was very grateful. Celebrities like actors Drew Carey and James Cann tweeted about how it was great to be in the playoffs at all and how the team should be proud of what they did. And lots of people simply thanked the Browns for being such a bright spot over the past year, like former Secretary of State Condoleezza Rice and WWE wrestler Johnny Gargano. They both have an eye on next year. And most importantly of all, so do the Browns players. Jarvis Landry, Mac Wilson, and Jedrick Wills Jr. all tweeted, we will be back. I, for one, believe it. Now, how's this to soften the blow? One Ohioan has a big pile of money on the way. One of 14 $1 million winning tickets was sold at Springfield Shell in the city of Springfield for the Powerball. That's between Columbus and Dayton. Those players missed the nearly $640 million jackpot because they didn't match one number, the Powerball. Tough break there. So now we all get another chance to win. The next drawing for $730 million is on Wednesday. And the Ohio winner, by the way, let the computer auto pick the numbers, Jay. Now I know you gotta play to win, but I could use some of that luck. Yeah, you know, it's really, it's funny because you'd be thrilled to win the million, but it would drive you crazy the rest of your life that you were just matching the Powerball away from having $639 so million. But hey, you gotta take what you get. Stephanie, thank you so much. We'll see you tomorrow.